They were among the few to take poetry from the strata of academia directly to the street corner and right back again. Ladies and gentlemen, it's my honor and privilege to present Last Poets. Last Poets came along and talked about revolution and talked about important issues in the community. That's what spoken word was supposed to do. The Last Poets is, the, uh, they reflect the part of our elders that embraced and tried to teach. The Last Poets, but they was the original hip hop artist, baby. Come on. I tried to sample his voice off the damn near answer machine. That's good, good job. I'll be a dude. I'm like, oh, damn, man. man. This is madness. The new version. Yeah. Niggas ain't scared of revolution. Oh, that's the old version. That's my guy. Niggas ain't scared of revolution. I ain't really had no. One group of writers just inspired me like that. Harlem. Ha, 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 the one Harlem. thing that this album has done for me more than anything, it showed how we can take family members and just groove off each other and get something done that's magnificent. And I think it was, I think it was a divine order for my grandson to be the one that provided the music for something that I'm gonna consider probably one of the greatest pieces of work that I've ever done. The key right now is, you know, Pops, his pen is on fire. And when it is, it's like, you gotta take advantage of these moments. And man. you know what, and you know what makes that even work better for me? I mean, just having a pen that's working is having some feedback, immediate feedback. Mm -hmm. I don't write anything, and I just think it's pretty cool without sharing with Evan. Mm -hmm. And I get, and he gives me immediate feedback. Then I get the long distance feedback when I call Pharaoh. And to have that kind of faith in the ears that are hearing you gives you more encouragement and inspiration to do what you do. I mean, that's, that's the family thing that this is so beautiful about. That's why the only word that makes sense for that CD is gratitude. Mm -hmm. You got to be grateful. Mm -hmm. Like, I did, come on, you're a poet, you have a beat, you, and you're on the album. I mean, and, and the thing about it is that what's so beautiful is that you just took that on because you decided you like words, you just want to mess with it. That's what's Everybody. up. So anytime you get a chance to put on display something that's really from the heart, that that is priceless. So I think that we got, we're going to get some nice feedback just on yeah. that alone. The best part of it was the creation. Um, sitting down, making the music, going back, listening to the, some of the stuff that the poets were doing back in the days, and you know, just trying to bridge the gap between modern music and you know the past. This is a poem for all the poems that have been written, for all the poets who have peeled off a piece of their soul and shared their naked feelings with the world. Every poet that I, I, I would let hear that, everybody was just like, that's about me. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> that's, that's so right. true. You know, mm -hmm. just listen to this for, for good sound energy, mm -hmm. you know? And I think well, the, the one thing that we can do with this album that we haven't done is take advantage of, of social media, take advantage of all these opportunities to put this out ourselves. Yeah. So, you know, it's, it's one of those things where it's not only us coming together, but now we can, we can get the 110 crew on board. We can get all the folks that have come through here for years and been a part of, you know, what we've been trying to do. Um, we can, can, now, we, we yeah, can, we can start, start a movement, movement man. Right. We, we can, can start. Get that Without having to say this is a movement, we just simply start moving in that direction and movement takes place. The fact is, what we can do with our art, what I hope to do with my art, what I'm always trying to do, I want to heal. I want to help us understand who we are no matter wherever we are. And this music, I'm hoping it will help somebody just find themselves, recognize their spirit, recognize their life, recognize their love, recognize the power that they have, recognize the Lord that they have inside of them, all of that. If I can just, if I can fuse that into people's headsets and hearts, then this album will be the medicine that we need. It all kind of runs in together mm -hmm. with, the, with the positive light that just shines. And that, it don't stop with gratitude. Mm -hmm. it's, a, it's a whole movement that, you know, we could use support, and that's how it works. I, I, that's, it's kind of weird, but I mean, I've got quite a few albums under my belt that I feel pretty good about, but um, <clears throat> this, is, this is, man, there's nothing that can compare with gratitude. Mm -hmm. Nothing. Nothing. Maybe if we can connect, we can get some monetary support, you know, it can become things that need to be done 
can become a reality. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. right. In our lifetime. Yeah, mm -hmm. in our lifetime. Yeah. How about mm -hmm. that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Feel what I feel when I feel.